What you are about to witness, like New Jack City, is a misinterpretation of the American dream. However, this is not a movie. This is real. In 2003, UPN commissioned a pilot for a reality series called Streets Incorporated. It focused on two young entrepreneurs from the hard world of Southwest Philadelphia, Ace Capone and Tim Gotti. Two guys who imagined themselves larger than the ghetto and as big as a Fortune 500 company. They wanted to do it with a record label and bring the guys that they grew up with along with them. However, when UPN saw the pilot and its unflinching, brutally honest depiction of life on the street, they changed their minds. Really, they got scared, and they never aired it. And it's never been seen until now. Two enterprising young men from Southwest Philadelphia had a dream to take their hustle from the streets to the boardroom. But somewhere in transit, that dream turned into a nightmare. Brace yourselves for The Hustle Diaries, Volume 1. Stand by. Tonight on Streets Incorporated. That was in no work for me, man. Mind your fuck. You don't miss it. You know what I mean? When my work takes place, you gonna remember that work. You gonna sit back and you go home and you gonna talk about my work. I ain't never been locked up my whole life, and the first time I get locked up, you're gonna tell me five with a three. He's looking at mandatory time. I don't think there's any way around it. We marketing it a one of our our artists real good. And y'all want some attention too. What do you mean? That's what you want. I don't care who club he at. He better fix that. He just ain't gonna make no money in my city. Hello, America. Meet your two newest corporate superstars. Ace Capone and Tim Gotti, the CEOs of Takedown Records. These are two venture capitalists who understand two things. The shortest distance between the street corner and the boardroom is a Bentley, and the only difference between a gangster and a record exec is an expense account. Streets Incorporated. The motherfuckers that really want to know what's going on in the hood, they don't want to come to the hood. They scared of the hood. They don't want to come through. They don't want to ride through there. They'd rather see it on TV or hear it in a rhyme on the video. Oh, video. Ah. The rapper's painting a picture for them to see, clear as day, what's going on. Man, when you black or from, you from the hood, the odds is against you. It's only a couple ways to get money. If you play ball, football or basketball, rapping now, rap, hip hop, taking over that's that's the only couple ways dudes is really getting out the hood man when you're from the hood man it's no way around not getting locked up the young bulls from the hood that's that got the skills it's amazing how you could take somebody young that only got a seventh eighth ninth grade education but can paint a picture about rapping for you so good about how the whole world is you know what i mean and that's why we got this record label one of my artists got locked up uh -huh. for shooting at somebody. So we bailed really? him out. We're here to pick him up. Yeah. What's the guy's name? Philly Swain. Philly Swain. He from uh, P.A. I'm from 60th Street. You know what I'm saying? First time I seen a nigga get killed, I was seven years old. You know what I'm saying? That's how deep it is out there. I guess it made me stronger, you know what I'm saying? It make all of us stronger. Or either break you, one or the other, and it ain't break me, so it made me stronger. What's up, son? Niggas getting out of line all crazy. Niggas had gaps, you know what I'm saying? So I pulled my joint out and start cutting, man. These niggas acting like they want to cut, so I, I started cutting before they could. You know what I'm saying? Before I could get home, by the time I get home, the law at my crib. Niggas snitch that fast. You know what I mean? You know what happens after that. It's a good thing y'all niggas came and got me. You gotta be careful, man. You can't be involved with that shit. You got a career, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. You gotta be focused, man. Don't let them niggas pull you in no bullshit. You know what I'm saying? You this close. Them niggas ain't got no shit. You know what I'm saying? They ain't gonna have shit. So what the fuck? They ain't losing nothing. 
you the only one got something to lose. That's why they tell him, you know what I mean? Yeah. You got to be smarter. Especially you weren't supposed to have that gun on you when them cops came and locked you up. If you ain't had the joint on you, it would have been just your word against his. Exactly. Now we got to see what happens. Fellas. Right. Make it the fuck out the car. You driving, so I can bet you don't want to do nothing. You driving. You driving. Man, y'all bitch ass niggas get the fuck out of here. Get out the car. Get out the car. Get out the car. Get out the car. Y'all was the niggas right. Y'all niggas snitch. Y'all niggas snitch. That's the reason why I went up. Anyone you broad ass niggas get the fuck out there. Man, y'all niggas is late, man. Corny ass niggas. Y'all niggas is late, man. Chill out. What fuck you nigga? Now I mean niggas snitch. Now I mean niggas still talking. Niggas ain't gonna stop talking, man. That ain't about shit. You know what I mean? Ain't know what happened the first time and it can happen again. I'm here with my soldiers right now. You know what I'm saying? They pull up three deep. Evidently, they must have heard I was out. That's how fast we're hit the street. My name ring, they, they name don't. You know what I'm saying? Niggas gonna keep on hating. But that part of this life, I've been living this for a long time. You know what I'm saying? Ain't shit. But I mean, I'm with my family, so ain't nothing. They let it escalate if they want. They can let it escalate if they want. Same motherfuckers from early. That happened in front of the barbershop. And this is just beginning stages. We don't know in detail until I get back to the hood and find out what's going on. Hey, Jack, what happened? I seen him come around the corner. Me and Philly right here, they go over here. On the same niggas from early. Right now, the only suspects is the guy that came up. It's the guy that came to the barbershop. That was probably trying to shoot Philly. Two things happen when you're from the hood. You either get locked up, or you might be an innocent, or innocent, you get hit by a bullet. You know what I mean? For sure. Long day. Hold Jack, he got enough time to design Rome. Don't even pick up the phone, because he know he ain't coming home. But to each his own, because that's not my twist. That's why I watch my mans and I watch my bitch. Let me find out. Woo! He went and made statements that he signed saying that he had the gun, it was his gun, so that's a problem. And the case is in New Jersey, so he's looking at mandatory time. I don't think there's any way around it. This can't be liars in the jungle when they kitties in the kitchen. I think that he didn't realize that by giving those in-depth statements, he pretty much hung himself. That's crazy. You know, I would think coming from the street and being street smart, everybody knows when you get yourself in some kind of problem, you never make a statement. Up. I don't think he, he really realizes it. I spoke to him on the phone. Yeah, he talked to me like it wasn't nothing. He's not too bright, this guy, is he? I guess not. Do you have tracks made on him? Yeah, I got about three or four. What we're going to do is we're going to have to flip it to our benefit. We'll tie it in with his whole case. That's what I think we should definitely do. He have a lot of time on his hand to just write. It might make him better as an artist, really. It's my man. You be all right. They're with my soldiers right now. You know what I'm saying? They pull up three deep. Evidently, they must have heard I was out. They can let it escalate if they want. They can let it escalate if they want. You went and made a voluntary statement and everything. You're going to have to do some time on this. We can get it down. Okay, but they're not gonna let you just walk away with probation. I mean, did you realize before you came here how bad this problem was? Well, don't you know you're not supposed to talk about a lawyer? I know all that. I never been locked up before. There's a Miranda warning for me here. You signed. I don't know what happened, but they didn't tell you you can get a lawyer if you want to. You don't have to talk. They just said what happened. They didn't give me no phone call. Basically, they made you talk yourself into jail time. 
it goes down, the problem is if you go file a motion and try to get the statement thrown out, they're not going to deal with that. They'll come down hard on it. And you don't have a defensible case. So you're between a rock and a hard place. So this is a three-count indictment charging third-degree aggravated assault, second-degree possession of a weapon for no lawful purpose, and third-degree unlawful possession of a weapon. We provided discovery. We made a plea offer at this time of five years in New Jersey State Prison, three years to be served without parole, which is consistent with the Grace Bill. We move for the entry of the initial plea. Judge, I had an opportunity to discuss these charges with my client and prepared to move forward with the arraignment. Can't win for losing, man. Fuckers don't want to see us move ahead, man. I'm 20 years old with a child on the way. They can talk about five with a three. I ain't never been locked up my whole life, and the first time I get locked up, y'all gonna tell me five with a three? Then suck my dick, man. How about that? Suck my dick five times, then three times. How about that? It's always something, man. Shit don't never, ever, ever change, man. They got a place right there. You sit down in there. So you keep your motherfucking cool, but they don't understand that I'm already cool. I don't need all that for motherfuckers to teach me I'm cool. Let's get out of here, man. That's one of my top artists, it's Bugsy. Be you, it's cracking. Uh, it's fun, but business is business. I gotta get back to the album, man. Okay, I see we all going with this one. I see how I feel to be on the outside looking in. I feel like. Feel like I made it already, man. Smile, bro, my way, let's play, okay? Damn, it was all good just a week ago, but now I feel like I'm already eating dough. And all I did was sign the contract. Now I'm the dude. It's crazy, man. Hard work, man. Contact, but never mind that I'm on top. I'm gonna take it back. I'm from the new school. I'm the leader of the new school. Remember this face. Yeah, Bugsy. See them platinum plaques on the wall? That's what I'm trying to get into, man. Okay. So yeah, Ace and Tim, they my saviors, man, about right now. Because without them, I'd probably be selling crack or blocked up or something. But they saved me. And they peeped I had a gift, a platinum gift. Hey, Bugs. You. Look, when you're doing it, right? Yeah. When you're first on, you be like, damn, it was all good just a week ago. Put What's some cat. Put show him, show him what I'm trying like, to put. Damn, put some character good. in it. Like, like damn. All right. Damn. Yeah. It was all good just a week ago. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Damn. It was all bad just a week ago. That's it. Now that's how I want like it. Just like on. that. And all I did was sign a contract. Now I'm the dude, but just want to find in contact. Who fucking with this? This ain't folks from P.A. You know what I'm saying? Southwest Philly Zone is folks. I let the nine meet you. Hello, matter of fact, goodbye. Cause when I shoot it, you die. No lie, I try to be calm, cool, and collective. But if I'm disrespected, the eight all get loose in a few seconds. Woo! Check it, check it. I can swear that since I've been signed with Takedown for this year, right? I did the less amount of music that I ever did since I've been rapping. I'm on top of the earth, I know it hurts. I got the heart of a lion, you can see it through my shirt. I breeze to get turf, see get chicks, see get smirk. Later on, when it's on, I'ma ease through a skirt. Come on. That's it. You can make 40 off a brick, already, man. but one round can beat that. It's my world, my way. Let's play. Rough times. We're right here on the station, banging and popping R&B. Hey, Dre, guess what? Freestyle? Bugsy's in the building, man. With a train pass, frontin' with your lane earns. I'll pop the thing fast and pop you in your name tag. You ain't holdin' nothing. I unload in public, tell a cop to eat up. What? Put me in the hole. Uh, I do it big. I show you how to do it, kid. Rappin' ain't for everybody. You should get a newer gig. Now every thing a chick on my heels and shit eat the... Uh, just to sit on my wheels. Holla, be you. I ain't get my bag of tricks out on them. I ain't want to curse and shit. The whole problem with this case is Philly came forward to be an honest man to try to clear the matter up.
and not understand the system. He's in, in a worse predicament. That's what the problem is right now. Philly, the way you got to look at it is you got a way out through your music career and through the label. So I think you should minimize the problem. Whatever consequences they are, serve your time. Get your record done before you go in and move on with your career. I think if you go and fight the system, it's too risky. The odds are in your favor. And if you lose, you could be sitting in there for three, four years. There might not be a career when you get out. I live this shit, man. I live this shit. I have no other choice but to live it. If I had another choice, I wouldn't be motherfucking going to jail, yeah. We all be sudden, basically. I guess he upset about the situation that he put himself in. How can you promote somebody that's in jail? You can't do nothing. You can't do no show, you can't do nothing. You know what I'm saying? How can you do anything? Everything that I do in my life, I gotta be responsible for. Everything in your life, you gotta be responsible for. So he can't, he can't sit there and push something that you chose to do on nobody else. You gotta fess up and be a man and stand up, and you can't cry like a little baby. You know what I'm saying? Then after you find out that you actually do got to do some time for something that you did, that I didn't tell you to do nothing like that. Only thing I'm trying to do is help you get out of the situation that you put yourself in. Let me, uh, let me see what we can do. I, 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 they, they definitely want to just get done with it. You know what I mean? Sit down and talk to you. And, you know, air out all the dirty laundry. I'm about to go to jail, and I'm still not hearing nothing about promoting Philly. Like, all right, so I'm supposed to fall back. If I fall back, I may fall away. You know what I'm saying? Word. I don't even know the rules and shit. Word. Yeah. Tim. Tim, come on. Tim, come. Yeah, Tim, come. somehow, some way, it ain't got nothing to do with nothing else. It's not really like that big a deal. What type of promotion can we get, if any? Like, where do we stand? Like, you already know where we stand, you know what I mean? We can't promote more than two artists at the same time. We're already promoting bugs. If you're a coach of a team and you got 20 players, how many you gonna pick to start? You gotta always pick starting five, right? So if you got, if you gotta bet your money on one of the players, who you gonna bet on? I'm gonna bet on one of the players I think the nicest. All right, Bugsy, we feel as though it's ready. He the nicest right now. Bugsy got video done. Ratchet and surviving. Rough times. <laughs> Holla. Y'all think you know what it is, we. Ratchet and surviving. Uh-oh. Yeah. Young Free take down records, and we. Ratchet and surviving. Yeah. It's going to be a long winner. Uh. Ratchet and surviving. Surviving. It's the rap. I'm a survivor. If you f off with the kid, the kid end up taking your mama. Strap, play with the mama. Strap, can't do nothing about it. Take your sh and divide it. Me and take down. Clap uh, if it wasn't for rap. So ain't you lucky we got it? Strap came from the bottom. Strap and we've been moving and shaking. I got Jake moving and baggies, the red and the blue ones. And I'm there when they move in a strip perk and light and free squirt your face. You up with my union. Get your last supper ruined. My team moves like who scrap, play with the yeah. rifle scrap. Don't play with your life scrap, be right back. Roll up on them on the night shift with a Mac and a K, a pump and a ooze. And then my team keep it moving like we's in the shake and holler. The American dreams to scream with the cash, my team. Surviving, we scratch the bottom, we fall united, we stand up and. We stand alive, serving the smoke, we're scraping the beams, the fiends. Yup. Surviving, man. Uh, 
young snake oh. Flow flow flo worth one with eight zeros I cop the joys I had when I was eight years old Digging, talking about platinum, still chasing gold It's all yada, 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 nowadays it's old So I cop white and slang Off oh, rap, copyright my slang It's this dude who gave Poppy his name It's S-N-A-K-A -A. We take down edge, they be um And we survive and fly like Beatrice In his eye when they rhyme beneath practice yeah. With weed like a cactus, the stickiest grain I'm vicious and mean, about to put blocks in the drought Play the cut like band-aids, the cop was out yeah. It's right with my uh. in they mouth Cut the trash like Oscar the Grouch I keep that, I'm boxing it out I'm surviving, I suck as a mouth The American dreams, the scream with the cash, my team Survivor, we scratch the bottom, we fall, united, we stand up and We stand alive, serving the smoke, we're scraping the beams, the fiends Yup, we I'ma do my thing, I'ma do my thing But if rapping don't have it, I'ma do it with Kane And then I'm right back, back to the straw on the plate, the raw on the weight Me against the law in the state, facing the judge, shaking the jury, paying my lawyer Saving a quarter, saving a profit, trying to get my cake in order. I'm an outlaw, almost for the case in Florida. It's Bugsy in the house, without a doubt. I'm that uh -huh. with coke every smoke smoke talk, talk about. about. I'm a scratch and survive. With a rap and ride, I hope everybody strapped to side. Let's go. Play the way, let's move it. I'ma show you how Bugsy do it. It's nothing to it, peep it. I'm the uh -huh. crack house landlord, got a hundred grand for it. Anybody thinking they can stay in the ball, let's get yeah, it American in. American dreams, the scream with the cash, my team. Surviving, we scratch the bottom, we fall united, we stand up and We stand alive, serving the smoke, we're scraping the beams, the fiends And looking hard, it's some takedown that'll put you with gold. He on TV, he on radio constantly, he's known as a takedown artist. He's on a hot single that's getting pushed not only in Philly, nationally. But y'all have never even gave us the chance to say, yo, let me hear you say all this. Let me hear you spit to it. Again. We got the chance. Bro. Again. Y'all got all the answers. They start coming to the studio what? fucking with us and shit like that. Like, I'm gonna call them like, yo, come on to the studio. Everybody know we was in the studio every single day. Like, damn, they're 24 hours a day working on the album. They could have came in there and jumped on the song. I ain't gonna fucking shake I ain't gonna kiss nobody ass to get on the song. He the most consistent. Everything he touched was gold. Well, we don't touch nothing, though. Stop being envious. All right, well, my bad, envious. I mean, this is the same thing. Envy. You say right here you want motherfuckers to know who P.A. is. Motherfuckers don't even know we down with takedown. That's what you want, right? It may seem like that. But uh, it's not really, that's not really how I look at this situation. I look uh, at this situation. Uh, you, you, you painting it, you painting it like you hating. That's how you painting it. That's how you paint the picture. When you get off the phone with a motherfucker and you said some shit, let me tell you, you best believe two seconds later they bringing the shit out my phone and telling me word for word what you just said. Every fucking time you turn around, it's something, controversy. Yo, why they talking shit? Why they, I'm like, man, this nigga. And it get to the point where you start being a pain in the ass, be like, man. That nigga don't want nothing. You know what I mean? Me and him run this label, not you. So don't question nothing we do. Just worry about what you want for you. Don't worry about why I couldn't get on this song, why I couldn't get on that song. It's not your job to think. All your job to do is rap. Cool? You should put that record together now. Have that record in the can and then let him start his time. Your record will be in the can and he'll be in the can. This is Swain family. It's only like six of us. You know what I mean, CES, Cheryl Ann Swain, that's my mom, Philly. That's me, my brother, my little sister, and my two daughters. All right. 
I've been grinding, hustling, scratching since I was 10 years old. They talking that heavy time, man. I ain't never been locked up my whole life. I ain't going out like that, man. Fuck it. If I got to sit, man, I'm going to sit, but they ain't going to like me when I get back out, man.